Honey, I thought we agreed not to recycle my old slacks. I wore them during the war, you know. <sighs> Adam, we need to talk. You're darn right we do. My grandfather was wearing those slacks when he cut my umbilical cord. Hey, what's going on? Bryson, go back inside. Well, hey there, stranger. Do you mind giving me a hand carrying my good clothes back inside? I bet there'll be a hot bowl of soup in it for us when we're done. Right, honey? Adam, you have to leave. But- I just don't feel anything between us anymore. But- But- I've been seeing Bryson ever since you cried after I pushed the beds together. But what about the children? Adam, we don't have any children. But what about the neighbor's children? Goodbye, Adam. Give me a whiskey. And leave the bottle. Hey! Oh. Sorry. Jeez, what's got you so wound up? Let's just say what was once my ball and chain is now a ball and chain that lives in my house and has sex with attractive men named Bryson. Oh man, not another one. Do you really love this woman? And you'd do anything for her? She grabbed left. Then get your sorry ass out of here and win her back. You're right. I got a delivery for Sarah from a please, please, please. Chocolates for Sarah from I Still Love You, lots and lots and lots. Teddy Bear from Please Stop Closing the Door in the Delivery. Hi there. Hey, Sarah's not home. Oh. Well, I was in the neighborhood, and I wanted to stop by to see if Sarah's been getting the gifts I've been sending. Those were from you? I'll take that as a yes. So long. Get over here. <laughs> <laughs> And stay away from Sarah, you freak! Oh, not again. Don't say it. Insane. In fact, quite the opposite, for you see, I'm a bear of very little brain and long words bother me, so I find it only fitting to destroy every bread with a long name. You, Mr. Reduce Fat White, are next on my list. You'll never get away with this. But I already have! <laughs> no, you don't know what you're doing. Stop. No. No. No! Pumpernickel's the bad guy. Hi, son! What? You find out, like, right after the cheese bread escapes from the crisper. Ugh, you're unbelievable, you know that? Oh, I do. Oh, by the way, your ex came by today. Really? What did he want? Don't really remember, but he won't be coming back. What? What did you do? I told you what I did. You cleaned up the crumbs, remember? You said you were exercising! I was exercising! Ugh! Hello? Hello? Sarah, I knew you'd remember our song. 
Adam, if you really care about me, then leave. No, Sarah, I won't. When two pieces of bread love each other, they don't abandon that love for attractive men named Bryson or Slim Jim. They get married and spend their lives together. And one day, they even push the beds together and have children who can grow up to be in a delicious sandwich, or feed hungry ducks, or be the first bread on the moon. I love you, Sarah. Say you love me. Please say it. I love you, Adam. Hey! What's going on over there? Bryson, get out of here. Now wait just one fu- You can keep the bubbles. Yes! Let's go home. Oh, hey, toast. Oh, I love toast. <laughs>